remember. Firefly spit. DIY garden with, with me. flowers, flowers, bugs, 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 and butterflies. You, we can, you can each make. I don't, I don't have. You get to make one of each today, starting with our with the egg carton flowers. So, Malachi, pass the egg cartons. Egg carton. You'll need an egg carton. Give me a chenille stem. Green if you want a green stem. Or I don't know, purple if you want a purple stem. Oops, I dropped my tish tissue paper. A hold on. Where's our beads and buttons? A po a pony bead or buttons. A pony bead or a button. Blue. Glue. Blue. And if you want a paintbrush to apply it. But we are using hot glue guns. So Okay, so to start, you want to Okay, make, that's my egg cut. Take your scissors and cut off one of the cartons, one carton piece of the egg carton. See? One of these. Then, cut it into a flower shape. Cutting from the top is the best way to make sure you don't break the cut. I make you little feathers. And I'm gonna open it up. Pretty. Open it up like this to make it look flowery. May I? give it a little bit of a gap between each petal so that you can tell that they're different petals without stretching the cut. I know, but I, I want a beautiful stretch down. Like that? Like this. Then, take your chenille stem, pick, thread a pony bead or a button onto your chenille stem. I mean, you, if you're using a button, make sure Hope. it has two holes. Make sure it has at least two holes. I'm going to be using a pony. 
extra and then cut across it. Okay. I need a paintbrush for my book. There we go. Where's right mine? there, Sylvie. Right there. You and my kitchen chair. Mm -hmm. Now, put your paintbrush in your glue and paint it onto the inside of your flower like this. Stick your tissue paper square on. Again, don't use hot glue. It might melt the foam. Are you writing us messages? cutting a lot of little squares to put on the petals. The petals are going to be green. Yeah, this isn't hot glue, hot glue, so I don't have to worry about it drying on me. Not unless you're a really slow painter.
inside of the flower. Thanks. Uh, I'm waiting for the glue. Oh, I'm all done, so you can use my glue. Hey, now I have my own glue. And Malachi has his own. Are you waiting for the glue to stop dripping? If you want the glue to stop dripping faster, you can just wipe it on the side there. on the other side. There it is. See? There. Glue painting is just like painting, except for it's with glue. Mm -hmm. Let's stick your tissue paper on. And voila! And voila! The inside is blue. Look! What? Let me show you. The inside of her flower is blue. So crazy. So crazy. Now I'm going to use orange tissue paper. Fill strip. Hold on. How is many do you want? How many petals are you going to do? A uh, like. I only have two more left. So you want to do all, both of them orange? No, I want the next one to be, to be blue. I'll put the blue I already used. We're going to cut a bigger strip. Because the current, cause the scrap that no, I have No, we don't need left, that one yet, Sally. We don't need that I will one. fit. I've got two over here. Um, two orange and two blue. Thanks. Last name of it is Rainbow. 
some beauty rainbow. I think that's it. Look at how pretty this flower is. Whoa. See how it's rainbow? Yeah. All right. Let's put it in our special garden vase, vase over here. This is a. We can make more. Yeah. And we can. We, we could build. We could fill the entire vase with flowers. Whoa, that would be really great. Next, but now we're gonna make. Some little bugs. Little bugs. Can I, can I show them? Because I was the one who some little adorable, adorable, adorable bugs that a that a mom let us make. Okay, time to get crafty. Ow! They're called bottle cap beetles. the buttons and the beads. You're being really loud. I think we don't need to. Okay. No. So what if somebody this? wants to decorate them with bottles, with buttons with and buttons, beads? Buttons and beads. Well, then they can decorate theirs with buttons. And beads. For this craft, you will but need. I want to decorate some my bottle caps. What? But I want to. for better. But clear plastic Ow. lids. Screw caps are better. We are picky about the type this time. Uh oh! Are we hurt? Looks like you'll be okay. You'll be okay. Okay, continue crafting. Keep crafting? Okay. Yeah! Alright. Okay. I'm gonna choose this little one. But them. we're using these ones. But we we would prefer ones with legs, except for ones that you cut. Uh, you, you'll need to cut. Uh, you'll need the bottom I'll, of the lid. I'll use this bottom. Oh, share this one. See, it's got two for you and two for me. Mm -hmm. And two and two for Malachi. No, no, two for you, two for me. Because you can't divide we, six by four. You can't divide four by. Three. Yeah. So now, can you help me cut little circles? There we go. Use your sharpies. Wait. Oh no, Malachi sharpies. Sharpies. Use your sharpies to color your bottle cap. Tell me we're not cutting yet. I'm gonna use it. Mine, the edges are gonna be pink, but the top is gonna be purple. And the middle, well, that's just gonna be blue, because look, it's already blue. Whoa. How crazy is mine? That's pretty crazy. I like rainbows, so I'm making my crafts rainbow. I'm gonna have a red bug. Mine's gonna be super pretty colors. What bugs are red? Uh, bugs ladybugs. Are ladybugs. Bugs that fall on the ground. Some red ants. ants. Yeah. Red ants. Give it some spots and it's a ladybug. <gasps> yeah! And ladybugs have wings too, so. I We would prefer you make flying ones because we're going to use Well, wings. we've got some pretty cool wings, so. Yeah. We prefer so it'd be you. Awesome. We prefer you. No, well, you don't have to. You don't have to wings. make one with wings. I said we prefer. 
Well, we don't really. Not really. You I can make whatever bugs you want. We so you're want. gonna make. You're gonna make. We make whatever bugs. We we're want. going. However, we are going to make ones with wings. Cause why would a bug be red? Um. Well, it could be red as a warning to birds. Like it could be red. It could be red. To yeah, make, maybe if it tastes it's, bad, it'll say red to say. It'll be red to say, "Stop, birds! Don't eat me! I taste bad." And maybe, and maybe, it can use its red to camouflage into red dots. Well, where would a red dot be? On rocks. Are you sure there's red rocks? Eh. Where ladybugs or, live. It could be red. It could be red in a cave because, because red has lower energy. Uh, frequent. Uh, it red is harder to see in the dark. Yeah, it's harder to see in the dark than other colors. Mm -hmm. Which is what? Which is part of the reason night vision goggles make everything green. Because green is easy to see. Mm -hmm. But red isn't. I can help you color it if you're getting tired. No. Okay. Thank you. I'm just wondering. I'm just wondering. How do ladybugs fly? Oh, so there. A lot of bugs have two pairs of wings. They've got a hard protective shell that keeps their wings safe and dry. They've got polka dots. And they've got their actual wings under that. And mm -hmm. some bugs have two pairs of wings even without the hard shell. Like, like dragonflies. dragonflies. Yeah. <laughs> and butterflies. Well, yes. Because, yes. because at the bottom, they were, they were, they were a little, they were, they were a little hard to see, but they were a little half circle. Wings. Yeah, there are little wings and big wings. By the way, do we have any googly eyes? We have googly eyes. Where? But I don't think it's hmm? time yet. It's not time yet for okay. googly eyes. Okay? Uh, so now, I'm if not you want to, you can paint your you want to you can paint your bottle cap but if you do you have to wait until it's all the way dry before you glue anything neither of us are done yet mm -hmm. i'm gonna make a pink a pink and purple ladybug Oh, that's where the googly eyes are. Okay. Googly eyes are under the bling. They're under all our sparkles. You, you write enough notes so that we know what you're saying. My fingers are blue. to make new flowers. Mm -hmm. They're what's called pollinators. Pollinators are some kinds of bugs that fly around and eat up the flowers. And flowers have pollen, which is why they're called pollinators. And pollen is basically... Pollen is basically the flower's seeds. Yeah, kind of. It's like, it's half of the seed. So the bugs carry the pollen to other flowers where they meet the other half of the seed and make seeds. Uh huh. Bees so, are pollinators. Butterflies because, are pollinators. Because, because mosquitoes. Male bees, mosquitoes are pollinators. Because bees 
cat carry little bits of nectar and turn them into honey, but some bees... When they're picking up the nectar, they collect the honey on their legs. Yes. I mean, not the honey, the pollen. <laughs> and, and when they're making pollen, when they're dropping pollen, they try to... After they do the pollen, they do the honey. They go wow. back to their home Is and they the Is coloring? No. Oh, almost. Still got purple and still got blue. Well, it's already blue, so you don't have to color it. The edge is on. Okay, that's fair. Um. It's a purple top. Make sure it clicks, sorry. It's hard to hear. Hey! It's my favorite shade of purple! What song is this? Android Sock Hop. Is it? Is it still yeah, it's Android yeah, it is. Sock Hop. Huh. Interesting. No, it went through all of them and then, and then started playing Android Sock Hop. Don't sum up my fingers are pink. Ah! I'm turning into a ladybug. I'm getting black spots. Oh no! <laughs> Soon I'll be turning red. And shrinking. Alright. I'm not down. Yeah, yeah, just. Hey. What kind of bug are you making? A pink ladybug? With a blue belly? Whoa, I've never seen one of those before. A pink ladybug with a blue belly. Um, we're running, uh, we are going to start doing these uh -huh. streams every Sunday at uh -huh. 3, so yeah. make sure to catch us for those. Also, um, also, uh, we're going to... We're going to... I'm sure Grandma's going to love it. We fell over? Going to... What? Oh! 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 So oh no, the glue fell over. over! He saw... Uh... Luckily, it didn't get on anything. Going to need some time. I mean... Just wait. I mean... Uh, we're going to be running. No. Almost done. You good? Uh, I, I, I'm trying to. I'm good. All right. Uh, I'm done. All done? All done. Okay. Okay. Next, we're going to cut a pair of wings out of our plastic lid. Can I go first? I, I'm already doing it. I'm good. Okay. I'm. You can make them into whatever shape you want. Uh-huh. We suggest either cutting them out as a pair, like a figure eight, or having a flat edge. This just makes it easier to stick them in. Okay. Fun fact, most insects have green blood. Hey, you know it may seem invisible, but look at mine. So little. It's so little. Mine are, mine, my wings are oddly shaped. Oh, one more. Lady wings are little. Melody, can you turn this away, please? It's like a star! Ow! Salome, uh, put your Salome. scissors down! It's like a star! It is! Bang down! Alright! Pretty bottle caps! Now that we all have our... Oh, now that we all have our wings... Oh! Now this! Making a new wing! Mm -hmm. Is that it? Now, 
you can use your sharpies again to decorate your wings. Mine are gonna be. I'm putting little blue hearts on my wings. Thank you. Thanks Mine. for stopping your. Mine are gonna have circles and stars. Actually, I'm going to make one side blue and one side pink. Sharpie's not doing too well. Neither is the black, is the black, what, um. Okay, black Sharpie. Black Sharpie? It's in there. Uh, uh, Wait. Someone put it in upside down. Oh, Mom. Mom has one. Mom has Uh, can I have the black sharpie? I'm using the black sharpie. So hold on just a second, okay? <laughs> I realized something. If your wings are going to be a single a single color, you don't have to color them on hey, both sides. I have a question. Why do bugs fly? They fly because it helps them escape from Things on the ground that like you, like cats, yeah, mice, and cats, and cats, yes. And what about glitter? Glitter doesn't eat bugs. What about but the vacuum? Also, it also, it's faster to fly than to walk because when you walk, you have to go over all these hills and bumps. But when you fly, you can just go straight. Then what about vacuums? However, vacuums there are... don't eat bugs, silly. Vacuums suck them up. That's However, fair. There are disadvantages to flying. Flying, uh, flying m means you can't be too big, or you'll have to have longer wings. Uh huh. And you can't be too heavy, or else you won't be able to take off. Salmi. Stickers. We don't need stickers, okay? So after we have our wings decorated, after we have our wings decorated, what? You can glue your wings onto the bottle cap. I think I'm asking questions about bugs because what? Making them. Making bugs. Don't touch the tip, it's hot. This is why it's called hot glue bag. Why do ladybugs have spots? Good question. Why do ladybugs have spots? I don't know. Hmm. 
maybe to break up their silhouette. Well, it wouldn't because a silhouette now uh -huh. is yeah. the shape without the colors. Uh -huh. Why can't I make this stay straight? Glue them onto the top of the bottle cap. Salome, remember to put your hot glue back on the Malachi! Shh. I didn't put it there because my bug was attached. Anyway. It's got a slanted wing. That's okay. I'm not done with it now. Yes. Okay. But, but make sure you to put your hot glue. But you don't want to hot glue it to the table. Mm -hmm. That glue wasn't glued. But you don't want but it can drink. Why do we it's use hot better, glue? It's better to use hot glue because it dries quickly and it'll heat up and maybe and it might melt the plastic a little bit to help it stick better. Because it's hot. Uh-huh. And hot glue is actually melting plastic. Is it googly plastic. eye time? Always remember guys, safety, safety first. on mine too, but that's because I can't find another. That's because one of my eyes is a size I can't find another for. <laughs> I'm gonna use this little heart to give her a tongue. Uh oh, blue fell over again. Ow! I think, remember, don't get your fingers on hot glue. Do not touch hot glue. It's hot. I think that's why it's called hot glue. Sure. I sure wonder why it's called hot glue. Oh. This is so adorable. Uh, where's Mine? the bling? Oh, Miriam has it. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to take it all. Hold on. Mine's gonna be able to see, but has no top. Man, these would kind of work as shiny wings. They can't, they might. You could Wait. give your bug another pair of wings, like ladybugs.
play butterfly, you're gonna have to get hot glue. There we go. My ladybug has a flower on it. My ladybug has a my bug has a bunch of flowers on it. My ladybug has a flower on it. Whoa. So it, it and mine. the flower smells like a real flower, so it can attract a mate. Oh. Hey. Lucky! Mine is glitter! I know the pink all the butterflies go. Oh. Look, mine's flying around. Mine's flying around. Mine's gonna be searching for food. Remember, bugs always get hungry. Well, everything gets hungry. My bug. Hey, Miriam. My bug is in the markers. <laughs> ah, sticky. That sound is sticky. Weird. Sticky. Sticky. Unstick it then. Hey, Lucky! Mine is Beautiful Butter! Beauty Butter! Her name's Beauty Butter! I should give her some spots! It's not done yet! She doesn't have spots! Hold on, this is Beauty Butter so far. Mm -hmm. And this is Malachi's Bug. What's your bug's name? Bug. Bug? It's Buggo. Buggo! This is my bug. She's even got a spot on her eye. What's your bug? Laura. Ah. Because of all the flowers. Mom, I need a shell for mine. It's not going to be a real shell. She uses the flowers as camouflage. Mine uses... My bug is a hybrid. That means a mix. All right. Let's get ready to move on. But my, my bug, my bug, bug me, right. hey guys, my bug is gonna have a little shell shape of hot sun. All right, all right, okay. okay. But, but we're going to have to get ready we're to move on soon. All right. This is the. But this last is my bug. We're gonna be making this butterflies struggle. next. Buggo is a mix between a ladybug and a fly. Now there are two ways to make your to make your butterflies wings. Okay? You, you can use either kind of marker, but if you want to do it the second way, you Look need my wa mommy. water soluble Look at my markers. Mommy. So that does not hey! mean Sharpies. Basically, if it says washable on it, it's water soluble. Okay. Let me bring the wa let me bring the washable markers closer. Oops. <laughs> Use your washable markers. Oh, here's my bug. Use your washable markers or any markers to draw on your on the copy on a copy filter. These are gonna be your butterflies. Oh, I'll get one for you, Sally. Hold on. This is your butterfly's wings, so... You can also add bling. Make sure they're just how you want them. It depends on if you want bling or colors. Well, if you're trying to do... If you're trying to make one like this... I made a sunset on that one. You need to use water-soluble markers, and you shouldn't use bling, because that might disrupt the way it works. So if you want to make one like this, you color it with your marker, with your water-soluble markers, and you and count out. Make it into a cone like this, and dip one end in water and hold it like this for a bit, and then dip the other end in water and hold it like this for a bit. And then you need to let it completely dry. Since we're, we're not going to do that, butterflies, I decided to make one on its wing. We're not going to do that, that kind. 
kind of stream today because it takes a while to dry and we don't want to take too long. But we are going to make some pretty flowers, some pretty butterflies with drawings. Mm. I'm making mine having swirly I, patterns. I don't, I don't, I want to make pretty. If you're just going to draw on them, this is how it'll turn. Sort of. I, I want to make one with flowers and butterflies. And then this one, and I can I think that's really good. I don't know, but I want to make butterflies and flowers. But tell me, you know how to make a flower? You want to know how to make a flower? Sammy? I know how to make a flower. Well, I, th I think it looks fantastic. I know, but I don't want to make one. Well, then we can make another one. Once, I drew on myself with a pen and made a really neat swirly pattern in the shape of a butterfly. What'd you do? Oh, you got glue on yourself. It's fine. <laughs> make this ring of flowers all different colors. Belly breast. Belly breast. Belly breast, Sammy. Ah, it's and down. I'm 
to do hides too. I need a pretty cloud. Up at the sky. Who's looking up at the camera? Stop the camera. Don't do that, Tyler. You know what? I'm gonna put two dots in between them. My first beautiful, beautiful, beautiful heart. Whoa, that's a really good heart, Salome. See, it's a really good heart. Hey, Miriam, can you show a close-up of my drawing? This is Malachi's drawing. It's a beautiful cloud. Uh huh. It does look kind of like a cloud. Can I show them your heart? It's very swirly. I love, I love experimenting heart, with swirls. Look at her heart. I'm gonna put lots of hearts around it. Mmm, lots of hearts. It might even get the upside down! Upside down heart? I've never heard of an upside down heart. I hope this marker doesn't like it. It doesn't want to run. It's like drawing. I think I love the little bunny. Oh, sometimes butterflies in real life have patterns that look like eyes on them. They're called eye spots. Uh huh. And this can help scare predators into thinking they're something else with big eyes. And if, and and if they're. Even? Whoa, whoa. Like a tiger. If you have big eyes, that usually means then you, that usually means you're big too, and you've got big teeth mm -hmm. or claws. So the and predators the roar like this. Yeah. So the predators won't eat the butterflies because they'll be scared to that the butterflies will eat them. Yeah. Hey. My end's still not done yet. Uh, unless you're a bush baby, then you don't really have big teeth. Bush babies! Bush babies have huge eyes. So they're do eye eyes. eyes. Yeah, they're so do eye eyes. They're, but they're yellow. less cute. <laughs> but they're, so they're more creepy and less cute. Now, when you're done coloring, fold your... Fold the sides of your Miriam, butterfly. I'm not done coloring, so they not It's okay, it's okay, Salome, okay? Fold the sides of your butterfly like this. One fold, and then fold it back, and then fold it the other way. And when you're done, when you stretch it out, it should look like an accordion. Okay, so you do... So first you fold it in half, fold it in half, and then accordion fold the two sides. Mine's gonna have black hearts on it. You should be able to make it look like a stick. Then, I don't know how to accordion fold. You fold it one way and then you fold it another. Yeah, fold it one way and then fold it the other way, and maybe one way and then the other way. Hey, look at my stack of markers! Yeah, you got a stack of markers. Yeah, I'm gonna put one right here. Okay, I'm gonna put one right here. 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 I'm gonna put one right here
fold your chenille stem. Fold a chenille stem like this. Hold up. Wait. To get one. I can't do an accordion fold. Like, you fold it this do way. Do we say we can't do something? Oh, oh, Sammy. Like the other way. Like that, Sammy. And then like that. Fold it one way, and then the other way. So you take your chenille stem and one way. way. Here, let me show you guys. One, one way, and then the other way. turn these two things sticking up into the antenna. Look at my antennas. Need to flatten them out a little bit. Okay. Ta da! Butterfly! Ta da! Now, now we need unfold a clip. Your butterfly wings. And they look fabulous. Fluff them out. Make them look like. Make them look just how you want them to. My butterfly has heart-shaped antenna. Look! Aww! That's so cute! I'm having a little trouble. Uh-oh. Uh-oh! My butterfly wings are sideways! Oh, that's okay. Take your butterfly and turn the wings like that. My butterfly is the is the mysterious swirly butterfly. It swirls all over. It's My got swirly antenna and swirly, swirly wings. wings. My butterfly now, is the butter is the queen butterfly of the world. Take a clothespin. Clothespin, clothespin, uh -huh. and glue your butterfly to your clothespin. Um. You have a hot glue gun. No, it's I attached my butterfly the wrong way. No, that's how you're supposed to attach it. No, if you turn the wings sideways like that. Uh, oh, oh, like this. Uh -huh. Okay. Thanks for clearing that up. Now, if you want to, you can take the extra strings off the from the hot glue off. Well, yeah, you should probably take the extra strings off. That'd be good. If you don't want to, because it looks pretty, you can leave them on. Ta da! Now I've got a now I've got a butterfly. No, I've got a butterfly. Wait a minute! I have a butterfly. Like if I want to clip my butterfly onto something, my butterfly will be upside down. Oops. Oops. <laughs> Maybe. But I think I like mine upside down. Mm -hmm. Because that's how he sleeps. Like a bat butterfly. It's a bat? It's the butter it's the queen butterfly of all the butterflies. Great. I think that wraps it up for now. Uh, right. Can we get our bugs and our flowers out here? Yeah, let's get our whole garden. Our whole garden. 
I have an idea. Buggies are in here. Watch what I'm gonna do. It's a good idea. Oh yeah, that's a, that is a good idea. And then put your little buggy inside. And you can have oh, all right. easy transport for your garden. Thanks for watching, Here's everyone. Portland. It's moving it. So you can easily move it around. Anyway. Also, the, fl also, the flower can fly. All right, There's everyone. A butterfly. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye. Bye. We'll see you again on We'll see you again next week at 3, a at 3 p.m. Not, Not 3 a.m. 3 p.m. on Motley Kids.org! Okay.